Welcome back to my channel guys. It's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. But in today's video I'm just going to show you guys my new um, Vanity Planet steamer. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's very bright in here. Um, so this is the Vanity, Plan uh, Vanity Planet facial steamer. Um, basically it says it steams away steam away and cleanse for a spa like treatment as you guys know I just got a face shoe done uh, was last week a hydro face shoe it was amazing um, for myself I typically do at home face shoes so that was something that was different for me and I actually really really enjoyed it so I am gonna be doing that every three months and then a face shoe every month in the middle of all of that at home I'm still going to take care of my skin like I normally have been doing. But like I said, this is the steamer. I hope you guys can see that. And um, I'm gonna just jump right into it. So this is a true unboxing. I'm not sure what it looks like. I haven't seen, I haven't watched any videos where, um, you know, it's showing me how to use it. So this is just a first impression of this steamer and let's open this up and I think this was 50 bucks I think it was 50 bucks yeah okay so straight out of the box there are three uh, different color suction cups I guess you would say they look like this let me see Three suction cups. I hope you guys can see that. Yeah. And three different colors here. There's a like a blush pink, like a light grayish, and then like sort of like black one. Um, I'll tell you what they all mean in a second, if they do have any meaning to them. Of course, it comes with the booklet. Um, got the booklet here. It's so bright in here, guys. I'm in my closet in my dressing room and then it just comes comes with the steamer itself inside of a sort I want to say a dust bag but it's not a dust bag it's just like a piece of plastic which you can probably just reuse um to stick it back in if you need it to oh so those, these are for this area. I don't know if you guys can see that. Ah, it's so bright, I'm so sorry. Here, I'll put it back here, yeah. And, um, and just a regular plug, nothing special. It does come with a little Velcro to keep it tidy. Um, four little suction cups on the bottom, one, two, three, four, so it can stick on your countertop. Um, a caution tape on the back. Water tank is only meant to hold distilled water. Do not fill tank with essential oils or other liquids. So that's directly on the back here, guys. Um, and let's see, anything else physically? Uh, there's also a sticker here too. Oh my God, it's so bright. All right, the sticker here also, and it says high temperature steam, use carefully. And then it's just the on button that's kind of like engraved inside of here. Um, I think what I'm gonna do is let you guys see how it actually steams up. So I'm going to add some distilled water in here. If I can get it open. All right, hold on. User guide, that's what they have this for, right? <laughs> um, let's see. Well, here's the thing. 
it says oh I guess I guess it's saying no essential oils maybe in the water itself but here in this booklet these three little brackets the little suction cups it says essential oil three baskets oh basket three which will be the uh, grayish looking one or brownish and then the water tank is in the back where this piece is at now how do you get that open okay water tank opening water tank water tank power button adjustable nozzle and let's see this is just a really really quick unboxing how the heck do I get this open, guys? It doesn't say. Don't, don't judge me. Feature safety. Okay, so. So I'm gonna try this. This may be how you open. I don't want to ruin this. So I'm going to... I don't know how to open this guy. Oh, it must be from the bottom. Alright guys, so I finally got it open and in order to open this little back piece here, just pop something under it and pull it out because I did struggle. And this is the water uh, container. There's a line here for maximum and minimum on here, minimum and maximum. And then you just put the top back on. Actually, let me show you. Oh, <laughs> take the top off, put it back on, <laughs> and boom. I'm gonna add some water in here so we can see how this is going to heat up and how fast it heats up. So let me grab some water and show you guys how fast it heats up and then what I feel from it. I'm not gonna actually use it on my skin today, but I am curious to see how fast it does heat up and how much heat does come out of it. So give me a second and I will add some water and show you guys what my thoughts are, my final thoughts. Okay. All right guys, so I filled it up with some water. Um, I think I filled it to the minimum. I'm gonna just plug it in and we're gonna count down we're gonna count down to see how long it takes for it to heat up. I have my cell phone. I am going to put on the timer. It's at zeros, right? I'm gonna press the on button. I'm gonna hold it. I don't know if I should hold it and see how long. So I'm pressing start and I'm gonna start the timer now. And then we're gonna see how long it takes for it to actually start steaming up. Let me actually sit it on this, and then I will show you guys. All right guys, so that's pretty much it uh, with this particular steamer. 
Um, they do have some the derma planning tool. Uh, I believe I said to you guys that my new esthetician was saying that I don't need to do that. It's not really for everyone. Um, so I'm not going to really mess with it for my skin. However, some of you guys may be able to use it and it really, really benefits you. Um, I do know that a lot of people, their skin looks a lot clearer and smoother after and brighter. Um, but for me, I don't really want to mess with it. So guys, it's already... That is, oh, that's a minute. It just hit a minute. So it takes a minute. And I have on makeup, guys, so I'm not gonna like, I like this, guys. I do. I like this. <laughs> If I didn't have my makeup on, I would definitely use this. I'm gonna just turn it off. And then, it goes down pretty fast. I like this. I'm excited to use it. I'll probably do a video for uh, my next video, a midweek one. So, um, yeah, I like this a lot, guys. Perfect, yes. And it's not too hot, but I definitely feel warm. It's warmth coming from it. Um, and for me, I used to use, it kind of feels like what the lady, the esthetician used on my skin. It just, it wasn't too much heat. Now, remember I was doing this my own way with the pot, with the towel, it was just a bit much. This is great. You don't have to worry about it getting hot. You don't have to worry about burning yourself. Um, I would recommend this for you guys. Let me unplug it. And I would also say to make sure you always take out any extra water that's in here so it's not ruined. It does say you distilled water. So if that's what it says, I would definitely use that. I have a hair steamer that says the same thing. Now I'm not gonna lie, I was using like spring water with it. I didn't have any issues with it. So, um, I don't know. So it's kind of pretty much up to you. Whatever you see fits best for you. But that's it. This is just a quick, this was just a quick review of this Vanity Planet Facial Cleanser. Steamer, sorry. Facial Cleanser. And I think it's cute. I'm actually going to pop it on my counter next to the rest of my things in there. And kind of have like a cute little setup for my, my skincare when I'm home. Um, and not at the esthetician. So... If you like videos like this, guys, please comment below. I also want you guys to like this video so it can also be shared on YouTube to other members of YouTube. Um, and if you stay to the end of this video, please comment, Coco, we see you. And I will see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next one. All right, guys. Bye.